different when you're growing up and, and you're a kid coming from an immigrant family and you're watching people on TV that don't look like you succeed, but then you see one person that looks like you succeed and it gives you reality to your dreams. It's like a bridge. Like, oh shit, she could do it, I could do it. She's brown, I'm brown, I could do it too. She kind of set the tone as to what I wanted to be um, in terms of she's had an incredible career in pop music, in film, in television, in fashion. She's such a feminist trailblazer and I am so inspired by her and so honored to, to be here tonight to see her perform. I love her, uh, I love her career, and uh, I would say there is not a Latin artist that is going to say that she's not huge. She's huge and she deserves all the things that happened in her life and her career. I feel like JLo did a lot of things that people uh, told her that she couldn't do, and she did it anyway, and that's kind of what I live by. I have never seen a more committed dancer and performer in my life, and as a Broadway performer and dancer myself, I'm giving you the... Yeah. Like it's always so like boom. Yo quiero, yo quiero dinero. You know, J Lo's got hips, so like she makes it. She's like so she speaks out about that, and like she like really shows off her body and like shows her confidence, and that's something I admire a lot. Jennifer Lopez for me as an actor and a singer was always someone that I looked up to that could do both, but like to the extreme level. Um, and she's such a performer. Like there's there's nothing better than someone that can do it all, and she's one of those people. Yo, actually J-Lo inspired me because growing up my dance teacher used to like literally like replicate all her stuff and like so I, she learned from J-Lo, I learned from her, so basically I learned from J-Lo. She started from nothing, you know what I mean? So I think anybody can relate to that, like starting out with nothing and making it as huge as she is, you know what I mean? So it's congratulations to her for that. I have big moments with J-Lo, super excited for tonight. Um, I wrote one of her biggest records, Ain't It Funny, the remix. So I'm so excited that she's winning tonight. I can't wait to see her perform. Um, she's definitely been an inspiration just fashion-wise and just, you know, being a woman mogul. So very excited about that. <laughs> <laughs>